Hey guys, yeah, it is beautiful outside, but we came inside. It's a little cool, and I came in and I found this guy just walking around. Number 47, Tom Glavin, brave Hall of Famer. Your resume is really, really long. What are you're down here in in Dublin? What you going to be doing tonight? Well, you know, it's been cold and rain in Atlanta, and you've been taking better care of the weather down here. So I figured <laughs> I'd come down and see what it was like to have a nice day. But uh, you know, it, I'm down here for the. Uh, Baseball banquet here tonight, first pitch banquet for uh, Dublin Baseball and, and Softball Association. So have some fun, eat some good food, and have a good time. What are you going to talk about? Because, I mean, there are a lot of kids out here. they got to be excited to see you. Well, you know, you got to keep it G-rated, so I can't, I can't tell any good stories. Right. Uh, but, you know, just talk a little bit about my experience and what these, what these guys can uh, – you know, hopefully expect someday down the road if they get uh, opportunity to play at another level. So we'll have some fun. But at this point, you were hockey too, right? I was. I was a big hockey player. Probably a better hockey player at uh, at this age that these most of these kids are at. So it was um, a, a tougher choice when I got to be 18 years old. But I think I made the right one. I can assure you, you made the right one. Let me ask you this, because whenever I would watch, you know, going through all those years, which thank you for that, by the way. How were you always so calm, cool, and collected? I mean, because you would ace a guy, and then you just walk off the mound like it's nothing. Were you inside just going, Durr! or were you just that cool? You know, a combination. Um, I mean, I, I got excited out there, no question about it, but I tried to keep my emotions in, in check as best I could. I, I, for whatever reason, I had a minor league coach early on who said, told all of our pitchers in the minor league, he said, look, it, just go out there and act like you're doing what you want to be doing. Don't get too high. Don't get too low. Those guys in the other dugout are looking for a reason to beat you. Don't give them one. So for whatever reason, that stuck with me. And I, that's the way I tried to approach it my whole career. And I think I did a pretty good job because uh, most everybody will tell me I couldn't tell if you were winning 10 nothing or losing 10 nothing. So it's the ultimate poker face. It really is. I've tried to emulate that sometimes, but my emotions get the best of me. All right, real quick in the final few seconds, any projections? Braves have been making a lot of moves. How are you feeling about the season? I like, you know, I like their team. I'm, I'm, up, I'm sad Josh Donaldson left, but uh, do, yeah. you know, good sign with Azuna. Uh, so I think he'll fill the middle of the lineup good. But it's like it is every year. If they pitch, they're going to be fine. They got a lot of good arms, so. Hopefully those young arms like Soroka and Freed and Fulton Avich will take that next step this year and it'll be a good year. You're always welcome in the bullpen as a closer if you ever want to just come back. <laughs> no, too. no, I'm good there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Time to laugh, everybody. We'll have the full forecast coming up in just minutes, guys.